All right, Tom wishes to rent a car for a day. There's Enterprise Car Rental, who wants $22 a day plus 15 cents a mile, and Budget Car Rental, who wants $18 a day and 19 cents per mile. They want to know after how many miles would the price to lease budget exceed the price to lease from Enterprise. So I'm going to start with like a verbal model. I'm going to go ahead and write out the fact that there's two companies. Right? There's Enterprise versus Budget. And then, since we're talking about prices or total prices, we know that um, Enterprise costs a daily fee plus a miles fee, and budget also costs a daily fee plus a miles fee. So I'm just going to fill in that part. So Enterprise says it's $22 a day plus $0.15 cents per mile. Well, I just stuck a variable there, so I really need to define my variable, and the variable then would be the number of miles. So I'm going to do the same thing for budget. They told me that budget is $18 a day and then $0.19 cents per mile. Now I have to put some sort of either equal sign or inequality in between these two statements. And it says that they want budget to exceed enterprise. So that means budget needs to be greater than enterprise or enterprise needs to be less than budget. So I put the inequality less than in there. And then now we have a, a linear e inequality, a linear inequality in one variable, so I'm just going to start solving it. I'll go ahead and subtract 18 from both sides. It really doesn't matter which side you move the variables to. Uh, so I subtracted 18 from both sides, and I also subtracted 0.15x from both sides. That left me with 5 is less than 0.14x. And then finally, I need to divide both sides by 0.14, which is positive, so it doesn't switch the inequality and that will give me 35.71 is less than x, or in other words, x has to be greater than 35.71. So back in the context then, um, then the number of miles would have to be greater than 35 miles.